white motherfucker. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's a crazy white motherfucker. And Mr. Wright, I'm saying right, not white. Mr. Oh, Mr. Wright. Mr. Wright. Mr. Wright got us all our jobs there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Mm. The first one he got a job there was Mario. Yo, what happened with Mario in the um path mark? He was threatening them. He was extortion. What, what happened? Don't ask me. I really can't tell you. Why you can't tell me? Because I really don't. Oh, I know he couldn't work there no more. He started, yeah, he started to talk him out. They wasn't giving him nothing to the projects and all this other shit. And all this. I don't bullshit. A lot of shit I forgot, man. You know, it's forgot. Oh, yeah. I mean, I started working, making money. I ain't think about none of that shit. Before his showdown with the Cowboys. Yes, the way it is. I don't know, because I heard he got arrested for that. Who? Mario. I heard that kind of messed him up, too. Yeah. 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 Do you, okay, well, at least tell me, what, like, what years was that? About, about what years? That was in the 70s. In the 70s? Like yeah. Early, mid? Early or 70s. Yeah? Or middle? Middle 70s. Yeah, around the middle 70s. Because we started working there, like, first it was ShotRite before it became Pathmark. Right. And soon, and when it was ShotRite, we used to hustle there, bagging. And when it turned uh, Pathmark, we were still in it. We were still in our ass, so. Yeah, yeah, I am. I hear that. And, you know, we would just walk in there and take what we want and walk out. Mm. Eight packs and none of them motherfuckers say nothing to us. Mm. Um. Yo, all this right here, I don't understand this. What? Yo, all these guys must have came in the 80s. Who that? Yeah, they did. They came in the 80s. Ooh. Um, turn it, look, turn it on page 77 in there. They mentioned y'all at the plaza. It's what you do. 77, oh. Our anniversary? It's 34. Oh, where's that remote? What? Remote. Here's the remote. Wow, which one? To turn it down. Yo, man, come here and interrupt me on my football oh, yeah. day, man. Oh, yeah, ain't start yet. I still like to listen to my preview shows. All right. <laughs> I'm almost done. Yo, yeah. Well, okay, I'm, I'm for me now. Wait a minute. It's like towards the uh, end. Like I know. It's the man therapy. with the master plan. John Brown. I think DJ John. You ever remember that? Yeah. What? Wait a minute. What? Hold up. Who wrote this shit? I don't know. Though. I didn't wrote read it the... at the same time. Discos were suffering down, and houses parties were declining. Parties because wait, parties because I ain't mean, stand so can't fucking spell right and write nothing right. Part parties because gangs like the Black Spains were making them unsafe. Yeah, they blame it on y'all. <laughs> unsafe. Yeah, they blamed it on y'all. See what? <laughs> yeah, y'all get the blame in the history for a lot of things, Mike. Holy shit, ain't this a bitch? Yeah. We, oh my god, yo, man, look at this dude. What's his name, Jeff Chang? Yeah, I think so. Who the fuck is Jeff Chang? Yeah. What'd he don't think? know, wait a minute, for number one, he don't know who the fuck we were. Okay. And for number two, I would like to meet that fucking Jeff Chang. Talking okay. About we, we messed up parties. Every party we went to, we did not mess up. It's just that the women came our way, and the other people there and the boys didn't like it. They ain't like it. We didn't mess it up. Right. They did. Okay. Shit, the girls at Black Space said, if the girls come to us, right. what can we do? Wherever we went, we took control. Mm. And we didn't mean to do it. Right. But anytime girls say, oh yeah, there's space here. 
First Division. Boom. Hmm. If the girls come to us, right. what can we do? Right. <laughs> what can we do? So, so all that bullshit, Jeff Chen, I would like to meet this idiot. He's an idiot. Yeah. And I'm saying he's an idiot. Mm. He don't know what's going on. Yeah. He wasn't there. He probably went yeah. by word say. And word say that any party we went to, we never started no trouble. Huh. We never we went never? to the party. Yeah. yeah. Party and that was it. And the girls just fell in love with us. That's all it went. Because <laughs> we were suave. That's all. At the time, so, we were suave. I'm talking about y'all wearing the colors days, back when y'all was wearing the colors. What about that? We wearing our colors? If they ain't afraid, that's on them. Y'all was bullies. Y'all was what, not <laughs> no bullies, man. I'm saying we were bullies. Y'all wasn't bullies? No. We did not bu- no. You, Blackie, coming to the party. Let me explain back something. Y'all Let was me explain something. 18. Let me explain something. What? We were not bullies. Y'all wasn't bullies? No. We go to a party. The girls come our way. Right. And that's how, that's how it was. And dudes didn't like it. They didn't like it. No. So, so that mean we bullied? We bullied? We didn't bully our way in. Why they let us in if we bullied our way in? Yeah. Yeah. We so, ain't bullying. We ain't mess up no parties. And if anything, we made a party. Okay. We made a party. Because every time we used to go to parties, them jackets would be standing on walls. Mm. Holding up the wall. Okay. Come on, man. This guy, Jeff Chang, don't know what he wrote. <laughs> Get out of here. Yeah. I'd like to meet this idiot. And then it said, like, the crowd of the Campbells, early Sedgwick Park. Cedric parties. You didn't give me shit about no Cedric Avenue and all that other bullshit. What do you mean? What do you mean? We didn't go to no parties over there. In Cedric, right? It was nothing going on over Ain't there. Ain't nothing right? was going on in Cedric? Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, that's what I'm trying to figure out. They trying to say that's the birth of it over all the way on Cedric by the highway. The birth of what? Hip hop. The birth of who? Hip hop on Cedric Avenue. That one little building over there. This is not. Especially back in the day, this was not considered the hood at all. And I encourage all real hip hop heads to come here and look at this. You know what I'm saying? I encourage all real hip hop heads to come here because this is not what I expected as the home of hip hop. By the highway. See, you gotta realize one thing. <laughs> realize this. Yeah. If nobody investigates it, right. they can say anything they want. Right, right. All the politicians, they had a memorial out there. Ruben Diaz, they named the Hip Hop Boulevard. Listen. They put a sign out there and listen, everything. They lied to they, them to whoever. Who you say? What was his name? Oh, Ruben Diaz. Ruben Diaz. Right. It must have been the son, because they sure couldn't tell yeah. it to the father. Yeah, they couldn't say it to the father, right? Yeah, that's so told the, the son going to believe it. Right, the son. He wasn't there. And mostly, and I'm not prejudiced, man. Right? I'm right. mostly over at Cedric Avenue at the time. Puerto Ricans. Oh yeah? Was Puerto Ricans over there? You had Puerto Ricans, you had a few, at our time. When we was coming up, you had whites. White people over there on Sedgwick. Wow. You had white people. White people was number full. Sedgwick Avenue was full of number of white people. Wow. Back in the 70s, 60s and 70s. Mm. That 80s stuff, we was long gone. No, well this is 73 they saying. No, come on. On 70- Sedgwick on 73, what was going on? 73? We weren't even thinking about Sedgwick and yeah. We were working. Well, they saying so that's they the... talking about we went over there. They saying the they was partying hard over there. Now, we didn't know nothing about it. That's what. That's what. That's the point. Only thing we just go to party over there and, and Bronx Community Park College had a party. We went over there. Me and Faze went over there and the dude said they had carpet on their, on their lobby floors. They had soda machines. They had pay phones in their lobbies. So they wasn't poor. They was pretty good. Where you know? that on Cedric? 1520. I got to take, take you over there one day. It ain't far, you know, from here. But, um, 1520 Sedwick is two buildings and 1600. They both got. T- oh, you talking they about two, the one by four in a row? Nah, it's not by four. It's right by the highways, across the street from the highway. Herc's building, 1520. And then 1600. They nice building. 1600 is a nice building. Wow. <laughs> he was rich too? <laughs> he said, these buildings are beautiful. 
and they act like they was partying hard wait, over there. Wait, 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 in uh, 1970, uh, I gotta take you over hold there. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. You sure gotta take me over there, cause uh, wait a minute, and you jump right across the street from from the highway from Major Deacon. Yeah, from the Major Deacon, right? That's not Sedgwick. That is. It's a little strip over there, and it goes right to a that dead hill? end. It's like a hill. Nah, it's no hill. It goes right to a dead end. It goes like underneath bridges, a lot of bridges and and and. It, it, it Herc's building, wherever Herc is from, back in when he was in high school, his building. They say he did his first party in the recreation center, in the rec room. He did well, his first the party. The only thing I know Herc from, no one Herc from, is over there on Third Ave by Third Avenue. The 9, 169th Street in Washington Avenue. That made cool her Coke rock with the nigga twins like this. Because it was a 9 crew. Cool. Seas out there, you better stand clear. EPMD is a world of man. No, her is from Sedgwick Avenue. Over there by the from, Major Deacon. I didn't know he was from, no, 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 no. He went to high school by 3rd Avenue. Smith. Right. Alfred E. Smith, right, right, yeah. right, right, yeah. right, 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 right. So Herc went to Alfred E. Smith. That's what they. That's what said. That's what they say. And it's written in his little bios or whatever. Well, I didn't know him when he was going to Alfred. I always seen him in the street. I didn't even know the nigga went to school. Yeah. Well, okay. Well, he went to set. He lived over Cedric Avenue by a major deacon. They say they was partying hard over there. Cedar Park. You ever heard of Cedar See, Park? Yeah, I heard of Cedar Park. They was partying hard over there in 1973. In 1974. My brother. Yeah. What's up, Ray? Thank you, bro. Thank you. Right. Yo. Okay, over there, we didn't know this man. We, you talking about in 73? They were partying hard in 73, Mike. That's what they say. 73, 74, they was partying hard in 74. Well, I don't know, because I was working. Well, that's what they said. I was working, man. I was working. So all that other bullshit now, look, they talking about? Who is this? I know Clyde is the one bending down. Who is those people? Is that taboo? Somebody said that was oh, taboo. Shit. Is that taboo? Do you say that stabbed you? No. That's a taboo. You wouldn't see taboo with this crowd at all. Okay. No way. Cause somebody said that was guy. taboo. No, that, that the light skin dude. No, light-skinned. that's not the tag. That little soft head. That nigga soft and shaman. Okay. Oh shit! They got pop in here. Which one is pop? Who's pop? That's pop right there. The black the black guy. Skin. Yeah, that's pop. Okay. They just took pictures. Yeah. That's all they did. Who's take pop? pictures. Who's pop? What he did? No, he did. you all know. Uh, okay. Pop. That's Gavin. <laughs> Okay. That's Gavin. I forgot his name. These are the guys from Monster. Okay. And that is that WC with the glasses? It looks like him too. Clyde said that's WC. It looks like him. That is WC. Wow. Yeah. It looks totally different. Yeah. That is WC. And I forgot his name. Who that? Got his name. Okay. Got his name. These guys from Bronxdale, man. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, man. Listen, I started me, us, the main black space guys, man. Right. Started going in different ways, working. Yeah. Just having families. Right. And all that. We didn't care about no more about that disco yeah. and hip hop. We was getting dressed. Yeah. When Gators, Lizards, tell me, man, we, we didn't get but about see, that. But that's the problem. The dudes that really started the whole movement don't even care about it, really. We don't. That's the problem, but y'all don't care about it. What do you want us to do? But y'all are the beginning what of it. Do you, okay, listen. What do you want us to do? Well, you doing we fine, can, but okay, I'm saying. But wait a minute. I can only speak up for what that's we what did. I mean, right. That's the only thing I can do. Right. Everybody else can come up and make up shit. That they get them. As far as I know what they doing, they making them shit. Because right. everything they saying, it ain't the truth. Right. 
I was there. Right. Yeah, so all right. that bullshit, they be coming to me and all this. I don't want to hear that bullshit. Right. You want to hear the truth? Get all of us that's still alive. Right. And we can get all of us together. That's what I'm saying. If I can get us all together, I'm going to try. I'll try. Right. The only thing I do is say, I'll try. Right. And we can tell you the real deal about right. all of this. Right. Anybody's going to come up and say, we did this. They did this. They did that. They did this. Right. All that shit is bullshit, bad. man. Right. Make us look bad. You see the book, right? Did you read the part? Let Yo, me see the book. Yeah, that we started, man. But maybe, you know what, Mike, Mike? Y'all was so no. large no, and so many it, different that's, that's divisions. The was. That's the whole That's the whole thing. The whole thing is the matter of the whole thing. We were so big. We were so large. People were frightened. Not trying to understand us. Okay. They were just frightened. That's all. But people around our neighborhood, our vicinity, knew what we were about. Right. And we knew what we were protectors. Right. You understand? We did things that no other gang did. Okay. We made it we made it for yo, we really got the space up for because we couldn't go places because of whiteies. That's why. Right. You understand? Right. When we started kicking their asses, right. you see, they can go, we can go anywhere the fuck we went. Right. That's why the police work with them whiteies sometimes. Mm -hmm. You know, kill mm -hmm. them niggas on site. Right. Lock them up. Right. Yo, but we did it slick. But you know what I'm thinking? Because y'all were so large, maybe some divisions was tearing up stuff some, in the car. Okay, so and, but we can't speak for all divisions. But they, they, all they do is say, Black Spades did it. Yeah, that's it. That's they it. don't Come say... Down. First division, wrong still Bronx, space. Yeah, yeah. They just say black, black space did, did it. it, so they figured they did it. We all did it, right? Well, well, then you know how that is, right? That's a, but you can tell all of them to kiss my ass, right? Let, let me see this. Uh, I want to re read. This. I read, you read that read shit. I read that shit. I don't know who this dude Chang is. Talking about we went to a party and it was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, we went to a party and they we missed the party because everybody was scared at the party. <laughs> you don't go to no fucking party to fuck with my like No, man. Have fun. Come on. It did that, though. Number one, we were good looking. I'm going to say that straight off the bat. Okay. Number two, we had we had flair with our shit. Okay. You understand? We wasn't afraid of nobody. Okay. But we didn't start trouble with nobody. If it came our way, we finished it. That was it. Yeah, it says it says because gangs like the spades was making them unsafe. Yeah. Making parties, parties unsafe. unsafe. You ain't that something, making unsafe. I ain't that something. Just blame it all on you. Blame it on no that, That's it. They were never with Listen, yeah. let me explain something to you. Take, for instance, Castle Hill. Okay. Where I got stabbed. Okay. We went up there. It was only seven of us. Seven. Okay. And turn around. We in there. Two of our, two of my gang members. Right. With the girls was talking to, talking to some girls. Right. The projects didn't like it. Mm. So they started, let's kick their, I guess they were saying, they thought they could kick our ass. Right. But uh, we showed them, it was only seven of us, we kicked their ass. Right. Seven, I got stabbed because the one dumbass spade was so drunk <laughs> that a nigga take the knife from him and they had to stop me, Blackie, Monk, Mally, and uh, they had to stop us because you know, we were high. We didn't right. feel no pain. We was knocking them niggas out like they was falling off from rice. Right. We beating the shit out of them. Right. <laughs> you understand? We beating right. the shit. And I'm not sitting here to brag or nothing. Right. Right. You understand? And so when the incident happened, when I got stabbed, the project got shut down for two days, the whole weekend. Right. Nobody was scared. Everybody was scared to come out. Right. They thought we were going to retaliate right. when I got stabbed. No, see? We didn't retaliate. Right. We left it alone. Right. Mike, let me ask you. You said the seven. Now, people think, because the way it's been worded for so many years, My it dead. says... No, don't you tell me nothing about no band by the stuff. No, I'm not, I'm not talking about no band by the no more. That's dead. That's finished. Oh. I'm talking about, it says, 
This is how they were worded. They would say, um, they started off Savage 7, and because y'all got big, y'all changed your name to the Black Spades. So what I'm saying is, but no, even some of your own Spade brothers, strong brothers, believed that. They thought that y'all no, names was Savage 7 at first. No, no, no. We already had the name Spades. Right, Spades was came from seven of us right. that were top. That called, we just called ourselves the Savage Seven. We just okay. did that. But we were the seven that was always there at a game fight, whatever. We were there. So we were savage. So that was after the after spades. After the spades. The first thing y'all called yourself was the black, black spades. spades. Yeah. Right. Okay. And we just added the seven of us that was wild, right. really wild. We called ourselves the Savage Seven. Right. That's all. Right, right. So all that other shit motherfuckers thinking Somebody about. Somebody made up. I don't, made up. Yeah. And like I said, don't stop listening to what the other people say. Come to the source. Right. Come right. to the source. Right. Right. You understand? With all these people making up shit, making up all that yeah. bullshit. And yeah. I'm tired of hearing it. I'm tired. Yeah. I'm telling you, I'm truly tired of hearing it. Right. Because all that shit that they be think talking like this guy, Chin Chang, said we was going to parties. And, and we was messing up parties. Right. If it was other divisions, we knew nothing about it. Okay. Yeah. You understand? Because we never went to Sedgwick Avenue and all that other bullshit over there. We didn't care about no Sedgwick. We thought they was 40 dodies anyway. <laughs> 40 dodies? What's that? The oh, deadheads. Right, right, right. Deadheads. So it wasn't nothing going on over there? No. Let me ask you, what you said it was a lot of um Puerto Ricans and Caucasians over there. What it came there later on? Cause when we was coming up in 73 and up over there, they must have had moved out. Was there a lot of Puerto Ricans way back then? When y'all was wearing colors, they started, they started coming, coming in. in. Yeah, they started coming in. What was that gang you said? Was there a gang 123, this uh, Puerto Rican gang? Was there a gang or was they just boys that hung out? They were called, you were talking about 123? Yeah. It was called the Social Lord. Was it a lot of Puerto Ricans in 123 at that time? What was in there? Caucasian? And yeah, you had. It was more. Yeah, I can't really. I can't even remember. Hmm. Was it a lot of Jamaicans in on the? Yeah, what? What? Jamaicans. It wasn't Jamaicans. It wasn't even around. Then. It wasn't even around? I, I mean, like only Jamaican I knew was my sister-in-law. Oh, okay. Your sister in law. Okay. Yeah. And back in the seventies and all that. So you didn't know no Jamaicans? Nah. Mm. Uh uh. Yeah. Wasn't that many? Nah. It wasn't many Jamaicans. It wasn't Dominicans. It yeah. wasn't no he uh Hindus. It wasn't right. no Africans. It they came none. like in the eighties, right? They came back in the late eighties and nineties. Yeah. Right. The with the, the crack era. They came with the crack, right? Yeah. <laughs> basically. Came, I mean, basically right. I man, I don't even want to get into that. Yeah. And like I said, when we was coming up, it was just black and white. Right. And some Puerto Ricans. Puerto Ricans. Few Puerto Ricans, right. Few Puerto Ricans. Right. You understand? That's what is it. That was it. And we just made up the black space because we couldn't cross White Plains Road. Right. We couldn't go before they was up on Watson Avenue. It was Jewish and Italians up there. Right. A few Puerto Ricans, a few blacks. Right. You understand? And they, they were, so all these people that are talking this shit now, they talking about the late 80s, right. early 80s, and 90s, and the 2000s. So why the fuck they know anything? Right. What do Mike, they know? Mike, they got a documentary saying that Jamaicans started hip hop. Uh, <laughs> no, <laughs> give me a favor. Give me a favor. Give me a favor. Give me a favor. West Indians, they say, me, or Caribbeans. <laughs> do me a favor. I don't want to hear no more of that shit, man. I'm being honest. I went and no more of that shit. They did, they did that shit in fucking uh, Jamaica. Or, right. Well, that's what they, they say. Somewhere. They say they brought the Jamaican culture over here, and they came with the big sound system like Jamaica, and they started hip hop. That's what they saying now. Oh man, I don't want no. Please, <laughs> please, man. I don't want no more of that shit, man. Before half the world came to New York, hip hop was here. Already. Right. Right. I don't think it, wait listen. If it, wait, if it was there and all that, what the fuck did it come to New York for? 
When they come in the United States for? They can stand there. Why they come there? Why no way in there, man? Come on, right, man. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, trying yeah. to hear what people talking about. Well, it happened over here. <laughs> it happened over here. It happened over here. <laughs> See, that's because we didn't follow up behind it. That's what I'm trying to tell you. That's the whole thing about that, it. Y'all don't care about we, it. We don't. That's letting you know. That's what, that's the, but y'all the ones that started it. So what? We started it. Oh, so man. what? We started But you got to realize one thing. If they want to take the credit, let them take the credit. Right. Please let them take the credit. <laughs> you understand? But right, we, right. we know it's all a lie. Right. We all know it's a lie. Right. People my age, my my age, right. and a little older than me, right. they know the truth. Right. So all this shit that's coming along now, right? I really don't want to hear about it. Right. I'm you know, being honest. They be saying they start to break that. Not there. Not <laughs> only that. Not only that. First thing they gonna say, and nobody say anything. They was the first one on the fucking moon. Right. Uh, right. 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 Listen. I don't want to hear no more about this. Yeah. We know what happened. Right. That's why a lot of them. I be talking to my boys, and they be saying, "Man, Mike, we know what happened." Right. We don't have to tell these motherfuckers nothing. This is that, listen, I'm telling you straight off the right, bat right. what they be saying to me. Oh, yeah? I say, yo, man, let's just let them give them a little taste. Uh, Look, uh, man, I don't want to get into it. Yeah. I don't want to get into it. I don't want to be on this paper and all this other yeah, bullshit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They don't want nothing to do with it. Yeah. They, say, they say, in fact, my man, we know we were there and we know we started all that. Yeah. So we living on, we say, they say just like this. We let them keep thinking they did it. Right. They did it. Because all they going to think we did was troublemaking. And we know what we did. Because mm. the people that were behind us and all this, they did. Mm. Now, Mr. Wright and people at Bath Mark and all that, they know what's going on. They know what's going on. All the people that was in the projects and the whole project or in our vicinity. And you understand? So going back from Patterson Project all the way up to Neck. I bet you one thing, if they knew they could get locked up or something happened to them, they would take that credit. Uh, of course. Right, they would take that right, credit. Right off the back. And right, right off the back. Right, you understand? Right. So they doing this, this, this you know, say, no, oh, they don't know nothing about it. They don't know nothing. We don't want to tell you jackasses. Right. That's the bottom line. Why should we tell y'all anything? But then you're going to say, we waited 40 years to do this, to yeah. say this, and all that. And I'm saying this from the bottom of my heart. Y'all kiss my ass. Right. 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 And when my boys say, y'all can kiss their ass. Right. We right. know what went on. Right. So all that shit y'all talking, save it. Right. Bottom line, they don't want to get into it. They don't want to hear about that other bullshit. We were troublemakers. We were this and that. Yo, we just mad because we took your women. Mm. And wherever we That's went, right. wherever we went, we were noticeable. Mm. With colors or without colors. Mm. Bottom line. Mm. All that bullshit okay. that they played this here, they played that there. Bullshit. Right. All right. That's all I got to say. I'm tired. Right. I've been asking my boys for the long. Just, let's give them a little taste. Yeah, uh, I don't want it. Nah, I'm not doing it, Mike. I'm not doing it, Fat Mike. I'm not doing it. Nah, I don't want them to know my history. I don't want them to know what we done back then, and I don't want all of that. I don't blame them now, especially the shit they writing. Let them take credit. Let them take. But the that's credit. how history messes up. Hey, history. that's why people think Jesus was was Caucasian. Because they change history. No, listen. They think the Egyptians were Caucasian because they change history. Well, listen. You see what they did now? And they you doing see? it now with this they stuff. They doing it now with this. And so one person's not going to change it. I mean, I know you it. can't do it yourself. Yeah, but I mean, so I already asked my brother, boy, man. The truth man. never stays the truth. When you got a bunch of blabbermouths. That's right. But we got a chance now because y'all still living. Yeah, but and we got I video. If and I Jesus day they didn't have video. If I can't get a oh, get to them to do it, right, what do I you know. want me to I do? I know, I know, I know. You know? Yeah. Come on, and plus, be honest with you, they ain't gonna do it when ain't, ain't no money involved. <laughs>
Hell, this but how are we supposed to get money involved if we don't? If nobody know, nobody knew this. So some cash, five years ago, nobody listen, knew none of this. There's an old saying. There's an old saying. <coughs> show some cash. I bet you they moved their ass. Huh. Show some cash. And I bet you they moved their ass. Huh. So uh, I'm not trying to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, I said what I had to say. That's all I can say, buddy. All, right. all I can say. So, by the end of this, all that shit that's written in these books now, all this shit these people be saying, is bullshit.